I'm here in Bukit Batang, Bukit Batang downtown Kuala Lumpur, seeing this wonderful stuff right here. And I'm in the midst of it all. This is almost midnight at night, but yet there is plenty of people out right now. If you're ever down this way here in, Kua in KL, Kuala Lumpur, you can always come down here to this area no matter what time of evening it is or even day and just enjoy yourself. There's a lot of stuff right here, some instant bull bites, lots of food, lots of, lots of good stuff. Plenty of souvenirs. We even got, a, you know, the regular 7-Eleven that you see everywhere. 7-Eleven here for all the people. But, uh, may, oh, and I found a money exchange. So if I needed money, which I don't right now, this is where I would go to get it. So, right here in the Buka Batang area. Buka Batang. <laughs> got the old Starbucks over there. And a bunch of different stores and some gymnasiums and what have you. If I if I didn't just eat over at the Dome restaurant, I'd probably come over here and try a little bit of this crispy and juicy taste of chicken and vegetable. Some pork pot stickers. However, I'm a little full, so I can't do it. But we are we are here right outside the sweet potato factory and they're cooking some delicious looking snacks over there. So wow, oh there's some more stuff. You know, it almost reminds me of downtown New York, New York City. Lots of people, lots of tourists today. It's like in a, right now we're in a, like a major intersection here. Major intersection with lots of people. And we also have a huge, huge pound of bear. Huge a huge panda bear and then of course you can stop and get take take your pictures with take your photos with them and stuff for the whole family it's crazy wow can't believe it's already after midnight and all these people are still out enjoying themselves here almost as if it's daytime but it's not it's way late look at this busy intersection here the light turned green and everybody's going it's like a frenzy. It's almost like being in Japan, except we're not in Japan. We're in Malaysia right now. Okay, I guess we're going to come over here to I Love Kuala Lumpur Gifts, and we're going to see what kind of gifts we can get. Possibly I can get me some nice, good old uh, magnets. You know me. I love to get magnets for the fridge. Love to get magnets for the fridge. Possibly some t-shirts, too, but they usually don't have my size because I'm a 3X in American, which is like a 5X here. So, if I can just get past all this traffic right here, it'll be all right. But it all depends, we just don't know. Here we go, we made it across. We made it across and it's busy. And I still can't believe this is, this is after midnight here. After midnight, oh, and you can feel the heat coming off of this. Oh, I love gyros. Gyros, euros, how to pronounce it. What'd you get there? <laughs> Frozen Coke slushies. Very good. Oh, it's gonna spill over, you better sip it down before it spills over. Over here, I still on a, I don't know, pushing one o'clock in the morning, and you know what? We're over here in Bukit Batang, which is an area where there's a lot of nightlife going on. A lot, a lot of nightlife, a lot of food stalls. What does your heart desire? Sorry about the lighting there. Need to change my refresh rate. Nonetheless, as far as the eye can see, there's so much wonderful food around here in this area. If you come down here and you're hungry, you're gonna find a place to eat, no matter what your liking is, because there's all sorts of food from all over the world. All sorts of food here. Seafood, Turkish food, European food, Chinese food, Vietnamese, a bunch of souvenir shops. 
Fresh seafood, fresh, fresh as you can fresh get. Seafood. Over here, taking a look at oh, some wonderful durian, which I am not the biggest fan of, so I'm not gonna do that. Plenty of seating at a lot of restaurants. I tell you what, there's some delicious looking food. The people that have some plates right here, I've been noticing looking over there, and they have some making me jealous making my mouth water even though i've got a little bit of a full belly but i would still eat a little bit more especially after looking and smelling this wonderful food out here like i said there's a lot of people from all over a lot of people from all over a lot of europeans here a lot of people from i enjoy coconut but i have a full belly right now what do you have oh Maybe on the way back, maybe I will. We go down there, maybe on the way okay, back. Okay. I gotta walk it off. Okay. We'll see. Okay. Thank you. Should I come back over here and eat, guys? I probably will. I'll probably come over here and get something small to eat. Not too big because, like I said, I can't eat a whole lot. So, got the rest of the people coming. <laughs> papaya, papaya juice. Papaya juice. So yeah, this is just a wonderful area to hang out in. I'm not sure what time it closes, and I don't know if it's staying open this late because of the Independence Day, or if it's always this late, but I'll tell you what, it is busy out here today. Very, very busy. This is almost like a 7-Eleven called a KK here in uh, Malaysia. All these restaurants around here. So many different types of food. Most of it being seafood, but there's other stuff. A lot of tiger beer. <laughs> I'm a fan of these coconuts. I should be getting a coconut. Should be getting a coconut right now, but uh you know what? I think we're gonna get us a coconut right now. We're gonna get us a coconut. I got it, I got it, I got it. Very good coconut? Absolutely wonderful. Best coconut? Well, I'm gonna say the best, but one of them. And cold, and, and, and cold? Okay, I think we're gonna try this, a coconut. Right. Can I try one? One. One. You gonna try one too? I'm not gonna try one, but I'm gonna watch you while you enjoy yours. <laughs> I got my buddy here, he's filming a little bit too, and uh, we're both creating a little bit of content today, but when I see these pine, uh, the, 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 these coconuts, I almost can't help myself but to get it because I love coconut juice. I love it. And he's cutting it up right now, you see him? He's cutting up. Let's just hope he don't chop his finger off. But they're so good at doing this, that they have no problem doing it. Oh, yes, it splashes a little bit. Splashes. The coconut loves me. <laughs> coconut loves you. Coconut follows beauty. Lovely. Enjoy. Oh, you have straw? Sorry? The straw? Oh, of course I do. He's going to bring me a straw so I can try this. Okay. He insists that I sit down and enjoy it, and I'm going to. I'm going to sit down and enjoy this and uh, see. Ooh. Oh, cool. Oh. So, I'll let him do that. I'll just do this part. So, yes, here it is. What a wonderful. And I'm going to drink this down quick like I normally do. I don't mess around when I drink it, but. And you get cash back. <laughs> wow. Amazing. That is good. Not only is it good, but it is very, very cold. Cold. <laughs> How is it, Turtle? <sighs> wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. This is awesome right here. This is... It's cold, too. That's what I love. That's what makes it the best. And I'm hot right now. I'm hot and sweating, so I need something to cool me down. <sighs> Man, there's more juice in this coconut than I've had in a long time in a coconut that I've ever gotten. I think it's a chill going on the hot water Still drinking it. <laughs> Sweat dripping in the eyes. Sweat dripping in the eyes, but still alive. <laughs> Down the hatch without a scratch. That was awesome. That was awesome right there, wow. As you can see, not the left of this coconut. It's cold to the touch. That's how I like my coconuts. I love my coconuts cold. You would have loved that one. 
Javon, my friend, you would have loved this. You would have loved it. You should have got it. Why didn't you? Next time. Okay, he says next time he's going to try it. We're going to hold him to that. I like it. But next time can only be cold. So if it ain't cold, he ain't going to do it. But if I find it a cold one next time, he's going to try it. Yes, yeah, continuing on here, finding some more food stalls. They'd have a couple more things, but what I'm really looking for is some roti. Looking for some roti, but I doubt I'm going to find it tonight. Ooh, so much wonderful food here. Uh, masala food, chicken masala, these they had over there. Of course, they got durian. <laughs> These, these is the other one. Yeah, the mango thing. Those ones, um, mango the, ho thing. the ho hotel said no, no come in. This one is the No smell? <laughs> calamari. Fresh calamari.